there's a muscle that sometimes can cause problems for the sciatic nerve and it's essentially this grey piece of tissue here. So this is the so-called piriformis muscle that attaches on the sacrum and the top of the uh, hip joint here. When I'm creating these movements with the foot going out, the knee going inwards, this is internal rotation of the hip joint, which means that I'm stretching the piriformis. But if I create the opposite, this is essentially the piriformis contracting because it's bringing on top of the femur there towards the sacrum. So that's what the piriformis does as a muscle. The nerve goes underneath it. In some situations, it actually passes through the muscle. So in some people, knowing everyone, they have this condition where essentially the muscle itself is pierced by the sciatic nerve, which is very unpleasant and very uncomfortable. The piriformis muscle can put compression on the sciatic nerve, which could then resemble sciatica symptoms.